in thinking about my plan for the research project and uh, the timeline I would want to follow, I think it was useful for me to um, divide the summer project into a set of milestones um, that I could um, use as a, a frame, framework to organize uh, my mentee's time. And that was really useful in structuring the relationship and making sure we were making progress throughout the summer um, in the completion of these different milestones. In the SMART process, we were asked to lay out a scope of work for the mentee and a schedule for when that would all be completed. And in the case of our project, that was, you know, first of all, very useful to do because um, you know, 10 weeks goes by really fast, and if you don't plan out your time, you can quickly get behind on the project, especially in the summers when, you know, sometimes uh, we have a vacation or a trip or a wedding or things like that. So it's really important to sort of map out uh, how we're going to get it all done. Um, it, and it really did help us stay on track. So we actually stayed pretty well according to schedule. So um, we had to go out in the field for a few occasions. So those were scheduled right away because those kind of um, were the focal point for the whole 10-week um, period. We needed to know exactly when those would be. We scheduled those early in the process, stuck to that schedule, so we had plenty of time to analyze the results of our work after those field visits. So um, all in all, uh, it was a really useful process for us, helped us stay on schedule, and we didn't really have any sort of um, things come up that would uh, derail the project.